Hello Berry Boyos out there, it is Ben Berry here, and today I, t I have a video for you guys. So, about a week ago, I bought this. Now, you probably don't know what this is, but if you watch uh, Super Ray Dizzle, who's another art YouTuber on this, um, and I watch her, she made a video uh, of reviewing a giant pencil. Now, I can't get this in frame, but basically this is my desk with my calendar, and it comes out to about pretty close to the camera. So it's 44 inches all, uh, all in all. So I, it came today and I was really excited and I just, as soon as I figured out that it came, I it just recorded. So I will hook you up back on my desk. Um, and also like desk review slash, uh, like I'll show you what's on here, 15 subscribers. So subscribe if you want to see that. There is a surprise up there, which you can't see on purpose because I don't want you guys to see that. So 15 subscribers, you'll see that. Okay, well, I'll get you back to a uh, upwards view of my desk and I'll see you in a little bit. It's here, it's here. So I'll, I'll unbox it. I have my little, uh, pocket knife that I got at Mirror Woods when I went to California once and this is not my name it's my middle name so spoiler alert, spoiler alert it is my name so let me bring this up a little bit more it has a fragile sticker has my initials purple I got it in a purple colorway um and then just like an arrow at the end nothing important so it looks like it has staples here I don't know how I'm gonna open this Maybe there's like a little, so there's a little plastic tip at the end. A little plastic. Maybe I can just pop that on. So I, I think I did it. I got this off. I had to use this and pry out. Ah. I had to pry out one of the staples. So that was just me. Kind of with the staple just kind of. Focus. Focus on my hands, man. Why? Why? Focus, please. Focus. Of course, when I stopped recording it, focused in. But, um... I just had to pry it out by going like that and then boop. So, like basically I go like that and just wedge it out. So, there's a bit of styrofoam here. I'm sure that that would be the same on the other end, but I don't want to do that. I don't want to open the other end. So, oh, oh that's a graphite tip. Oh. Okay, it's coming out. Uh, oh, 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 there it is. Oh, here it is. Okay, so, man, it has Benberry on there for you. Uh, it came out all caps. Well, that's okay, I like it. Um, so at the tip, graphite tip, uh, I think this actually works. And then a working eraser. So I actually was kind of just reviewing this on Amazon. Um, oh, and also if you want to know, it has pencil crafted that I actually got off the website, not from Amazon. And it's on Amazon, but I just wanted to support the actual business and it was a little bit cheaper on the actual website. And I, when I was checking for it on Amazon, it said that this graphite doesn't go all the way through. That's why it's so like light. It's like I can throw it up pretty easily. It's pretty heavy at this end because this is like metal and whatnot. I thought this would just be wood. No, this is actually metal. This is the actual eraser. And yeah, so the uh, graphite doesn't go all the way through. 
for graphite, it doesn't go all the way through. It's just in like a beginning part, which uh, this side is still heavier, but this side is pretty light. If it was, if it was, um, if it, uh, if the graphite went through the whole pencil, then I think it would be much heavier because yeah, I just think I would. So here's a little size comparison. I'll clear this off, hold on. Okay, a little size comparison. This is a mechanical pencil, and this is bigger than normal pencils. Here, I can get a smaller one. Um, so this, this is even a little bit smaller, but that's how big a normal pencil would be. Um, and I don't know how exactly long those are, but if you were to compare it to this, oh man, that's a big size difference. So barely just gets like a eighth of the way maybe. Like that maybe is just an eighth? I don't even know. Uh, I, I, I'd have to measure it and I don't want to do that, but it is pretty, it's pretty big compared to um, a small pencil or mechanical pencil, which are even pretty big. And this one is a little bit, might be a little bit shorter, but it also might be, uh, it might be shorter because there's not the eraser in, but it also might be like sharpened a little bit. I found this on the ground at my school. So um, I used it. Okay, well, I am gonna get some paper and whatnot, and I'll be back in a second. And I'll clean up my desk too, because I don't want you guys to get mad at me that it's not clean. Okay, I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, I'm back. So, uh, if you didn't watch the Super Ray Dizzle video, which I'm sure that some of you haven't, basically what I'm gonna do and what Super Ray Dizzle did is they, um, she put the um, pencil on her shoulder and then we'll draw down this way. And I think I'm gonna start with that. I mean, I might kind of like think of something else if it's better, but I'm gonna start the shoulder method. And I am gonna sit down just cause it would be easier here. I can zoom you guys in a little bit. Okay. So I'm gonna draw, try and draw my berry head as best I can. Might not work out that good. It might be not that good. Uh, maybe I do it on my left. I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. Um. Okay. Let's just start. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Circles aren't that easy to draw. Oh. Oh, that's rough. Oh, I'm not trying to intentionally do this. Oh man. Well, now we can use the eraser. Um, ooh, that actually erases pretty good. It's just a normal average eraser. And like I said, I'm not trying to draw bad. This just doesn't have the best control. Oh, there we go. It's a little bit better. I'm going to try a couple more methods. Like maybe I just... Um, Do I just like hold it up? Oh no, that's not good. So right now I'm holding it up like, like both hands just like going vertical. And I don't think it's working. No, yeah, the circle isn't as rounded and I don't have as much control. And like I said, I'm and not intentionally making it bad. Um, let me see, maybe I do like I'm rowing a boat. Uh, how would I, maybe like under the arm? No, that does, that's not comfortable. Oh, I'm not left, left handed, that's the thing. I think just the over the shoulder method works the best. And then I just won't color in the little berry stem. Okay, looks a little, oh, oh, that's a not good, that's like a five-year-old smile. <sighs> um, 
Oh, oh. Is that, oh, uh, okay, okay. Oh, uh, that's a little bit bad, but that's okay. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, somewhat successful. Now I'll draw with like a normal pencil that I have lying around. So this is my good one, that's my good one. Now let me draw my casual. Well, I can actually color in this. So this is big, this is small. So, um, I mean, you can, uh, you can tell the difference. And this I'm putting on, like, I can actually apply more. And if I try and do that with the big pencil, mm, I guess I can apply, a, I can apply a good amount of pressure, but um, let me try applying more pressure and the thing is, I don't know how like detailed. Oh, that's pretty good. Oh, okay. Hey. Hey, I mean, the smile's a little bit weird, but compared to these two, those are pretty, I mean, that's a little bit more like of a sharp angle, but I mean, that's pretty good. I mean, if, if you told me this was drawn with a, big pencil i'd say okay i can i can kind of see that but it, it looks still pretty good and i'd believe you if you told me that that was drawn with a normal sized pencil um okay well i'm hoping oh this doesn't really have too many dents on the bottom page um or does it no oh, it does have a little bit well i'm gonna try my best to do an artwork and I don't know how I'm gonna do this. This is, I'm probably gonna have a cramp tomorrow. Um, just saying, um, which is probably not good because tomorrow I have school. But that's okay. I'm gonna push through because yeah, I I want you guys to see this. I was waiting all day for this, so I want to try and get this out. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, I will get back to you in a little bit when if I have any updates or if I want to show you guys something. Okay, see ya. this I know this is kind of just like a small uh, it's like a short video and it's this is not a detailed drawing it looks like a five-year-old drew it but I don't care it's my artwork and I drew this with a giant pencil let me actually label that uh, drew with a giant pencil exclamation point um i did try and put my signature but that didn't turn out that good it just looks weird now you can, if you you should go and watch super ray Dizzle's video because that she drew a really detailed piece and she draws realism and i don't i draw like cartoony like i don't know i don't know how to explain it but i we have different art, art styles so um yeah it's this is what I came out with. If you guys enjoyed it, then like it. If you didn't, um, like it <laughs> so I know. Um, and yeah, if, I mean, for whatever reason you want to buy one, I'll probably have the link in the description. Um, and you can put your own label on it and make your video drawing and it'll probably be better than mine. But uh, it's going to be whatever. I'll try and find a place for me to hang this because it's a beauty. And uh Subscribe if you're new um, and do like art because at my channel I like to have art and I like to do art and I like to anything art based I like to do. Um, 
I have a bunch of ideas. I have a whole notebook full of just ideas. So, um, yeah, definitely subscribe so you don't miss out on those. Um, remember, 15 subscribers. And I will show my desk area. I'll give you a tour. Uh, and at 20, I'll give you a room tour. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like and subscribe. And uh, this is Ben Berry. Uh, I'll see you later. Bye.